Her name is Ken Choquette. It's a French name. My great grandfather come from Quebec area of Canada, settled at Salix. And we have a family farm there. I'm still manager of that farm, plus I operate this one here. I have bought and sold maybe 150 tractors over the years, mostly Alice Chalmers. My father was a great Alice Chalmers mechanic, and I stood around and handed him wrenches when I was a kid. You know, I would go for this and go for that, and it just kind of stuck to me. You know? it's, it's fun, really. This tractor I bought from the son of the guy who bought it new in 1935. The B. John Deere. This is exactly the same tractor. When I was 11 years old, my dad let me drive by myself. Not the same one, same model. That's why I got it. This is a original 1958 D17 Alice. That's a good little tractor. There's hardly any hours on it. Just runs really good. I use that all the time. Well, the main reason, uh, the, the main reason Alice Chalmers is is because my father had Alice Chalmers, and he was a mechanic besides being a farmer. Well, the reason why Alice Chalmers was his is because it was small but mighty. <clears throat> These have as much horsepower or more, but they're half the weight, and they have a system called traction booster. Traction booster system which shifts weight from your implement onto your rear tires to give you the traction. Okay, I picked this tractor up using a new app that I found. A friend of mine showed me Tractor Zoom. I went online and I found this auction up near Alden, Iowa, with Mr. Whitaker, and uh, I bid on seven items. And uh, I got three of them, two tractors, a WD Alice Chalmers and a WD-45, which is the same tractor, except it's got a few more horsepower, a little newer, and a very rare plow that goes with it. So I kind of like Tractor Zoom. Works pretty good. You just punch it in there, and it showed up, and you see all the photos of all the Alice Chalmers. I think it was seven or eight Alice Chalmers tractors, which is kind of a rare thing. And I would never have found it if it wasn't for that. 